I was doing called do this when you wake up I have a clicker and I just got it for fun and so what I do is every time I'm saying something in prayer I started at zero let's say your faith life has gone down life has beat you up and you really need to build it back up well before I leave out of the bed I'll say a scripture a hundred times so what I told everybody to do was take a clicker and before you get out the bed just say I trust you I trust you, Daddy. I trust you, God. Whatever you say, I trust you. I believe you. I trust you. I have faith in you. I trust you. I trust everything you say. I trust everything you're doing. I trust you. Everything you said to come true is true. I trust you in this area of my life. I trust you in my finances. I trust you in my marriage. I trust you on my job. I trust you in everything that I'm doing. I trust you, God. I trust you. You're not a man that you could lie. You're not the son of man that could repent. You can't lie to me. Lying words can't come out of your mouth. I trust you. Who's better to do it than you? I trust you, God. That's shooting an arrow of deliverance. No, that's lying to God. Because since when you say, I trust you, and then you trust somebody. When you're in a relationship, you trust them. You don't tell them every day, well, you, I trust 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 you. No, you demonstrate trust if you really trust somebody. Y'all deceive. Be not deceived, y'all. God is not mocked. But whatsoever a man sow, he will reap. Okay, so the Spirit of the Lord is grieved. And this is why many are using the word of God as a form of witchcraft, as a form of rituals. They're taking a biblical scripture out of context. Um, Tiffany, Tiffany Montgomery has misled a lot of people uh, with this clicker this clicker she's informed everybody to get um, her ministry is called Covered by God um, and I just ran ran across a lady on TikTok who's actually doing this and I just had to um, warn her and call her to repentance so Tiffany is saying to get a clicker and every morning before she gets up, she takes the clicker and she clicks it a hundred times saying, I trust you, God. I trust you, God. I trust you, God. I trust you, God. Lord, I trust you. You say that in your word, it cannot return. Boy, Lord, I trust you. Lord, I trust Listen. All this belief for it and, and all this stuff, y'all listen. When you truly believe God, you do his word. You, which means you become the word, which means you live for God, which means you have his Holy Spirit living on the inside of you. So when you believe God, that settles it. That settles it. You believe what God says, that settles it, y'all. So then what does it look like when I believe God and I trust God? I'm at peace. I have come to terms with God and his word because I live for him. I'm waiting on God patiently because I know that he's going to deliver. It goes when you're when you have when you're living for God, your your faith moves from belief to I know to trust, which is a firm belief. It's not shaken. When I went through deliverance, I did not have to say, Lord, I believe that you're going to deliver me. 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 You said you're going to deliver me. You said you're going to deliver me. You said you're going to deliver me. I didn't have to do that. I had to wait and go through eight months of deliverance. Every time I thought it was over, God seemed like he started it back over again because he wants us to be anxious for nothing. Except by prayer and supplication, make your request known unto God and leave it there. And trust that when you, whatever you pray for, if you believe it, you shall have it. That's it. All this clicker and 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 and, and word after word, and you you sound like a slave. 
So that's my God blessing you. That's lip service, love. If in your heart you believe God, that's why he say confess with your mouth and believe in your heart and you shall be or will be saved. Believe with your heart. So never mind what I'm saying. Nico Yeti, my soul. I believe in my heart. That settles it. And if you've been born again, then your heart has the Holy Spirit. It has God's Spirit in it. Which is spirit and life. That's the word of God. The word of God is faith. That's why it comes by hearing and hearing the word of God. Your faith is increased. Make oh yeti my God. But not for you to keep on repeating it like you're trying to get God. You cannot put God under your power. You can say it till you blue in the face. That's not going to make God move any faster. That's why I say wait on the Lord. And keep his way. And those that, and those that wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up on wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. This is what it means. When you believe with your heart, love, that means that you believe with your life. If you believe God, then it's a belief. If you doing all these repetitions of the scripture and you using the clicker, that's witchcraft. And, 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 and that's works. You don't really believe God. Think about it. When you believe something, you know it to be true. So you, you ain't nothing you got. Oh, you, I mean, you believe. That's it. Y'all don't really believe God. See? You don't really believe God. Because if you really believe God, then that's it. It's just like when you make a payment, you know that if you send that check in the mail, you know that that bill is going to be paid, right? So as soon as you send that check off, are you worried about it? Are you worried about it coming out your out your bank account? Because you know it's going to be paid. When you live for God, God cannot deny Himself. That says it. That's in the Word of God. See, the problem is we don't really believe the word. We don't really believe what God say. We think that faith is about a work. Because all y'all like to say is faith without work is dead. But believing is a work, love. Show me your faith by your works. Show me that you believe by believing God. For real. And so when I believe God. There's an automatic work that follows. There's an action that follows me believing him. Not you clicking a clicker and telling him that you believe him. You lying to God. Because if you believe him, then you live for him. You do it. You obey him. You do his word. You become his word. You do whatever he says. He don't do what you say. You do what he say. You cannot bring God under your power. So God is not the one blessing you. You're deceived. And you're under a delusion. And all the people that you have misled by this video, you will be judged. You have a lot of blood on your hands, Miss Tiffany Montgomery. And so you need to repent and ask God to forgive you and refrain from using your clicker. Make you yeti my soul. Because it's going to click you right in the hell. This is the word of the Lord concerning you. Be blessed. Amen.